Even up close, the car is hard to see, surrounded by trees, but amazingly not appearing to make any serious contact with any of them. You can barely see the car back in that wooded area. There's a lot of shrubbery in there, but as you watch the path that the car took, you can see pieces and parts of the car. And as we pull out closer to the sidewalk along Silver Star, you can see where the guard railing was sheared off after the driver went over this sidewalk. Witnesses say he was headed down on Silver Star when all of a sudden he went through here. He was over in the far lane, the fast lane, and all of a sudden I seen him just swerving through the lanes and cross over from the fast lane all the way across the other two lanes and go through the metal pole and then down into the trees. It was just after two in the afternoon on Silver Star west of Hiawassee, the driver not wishing to speak with us, but apparently suggesting to a deputy he was cut off in traffic. I put my vehicle in park and jumped out to run down to make sure there was no women or children in the car. The witness says the car narrowly missed this man in the burgundy hat. He complained of enough anxiety he was taken to the hospital to be evaluated. The driver was out of the car almost immediately. He was standing outside the car leaning against the tree when we got down there, when me and a couple of other guys got down there. The Florida Highway Patrol will investigate. In Orange County, Dave McDaniel, West 2 News.